I guess we're back with Chester. So what we're working on is just kind of polishing Chester. You remember Chester kind of started out, he's kind of a lazy puppy and everything. But you really want to, but he's turned out to be fantastic, you guys. I mean, I can't tell you how tremendous of an animal this is, just everything about him. All right, so what you're going to do is we're going to just start working on the turn towards with him. But let's just start out with the turn away and then go ahead and reward him with the treat. So she's kind of keeping his attention. And what we kind of do, the moist and meaty, we kind of crinkle the little plastic to help get there. All right, so go ahead and heal away. Just turn away. So remember, you guys, we have two basic turns, the turn towards and the turn away. All right, do your turn away. We don't have the sound box collar on, but I'm starting my... I'm starting my pager slightly before. All right, go ahead. All right, you really need to pull that shoulder away, though. I want you to bend that elbow up and pull that shoulder away when you get ready to do that turn towards. There's no really hand signal for that, you guys, but you, there you go. But they're more aware than you think. That shoulder is pulling away. All right, go ahead. You see that? I mean, he's very aware of that. You know, they watch the angles of your head and stuff, I'm telling you. You don't think they would, but that's how these dogs can tell these people that are completely completely over invested them when they look at the people the people just beaming at them all the time all right so you're gonna pull your shoulder away so you can see chester's doing very very good with the turn well he was up until then with the turn away so now we can start the turn towards you've already got his attention with his head so let's just go ahead and use the treat to help guide his head and we're going to say he'll bring that hand around all of them are going to be different you guys but with one like this you really want to help their head needs to stay up what you don't want and what you would have if you weren't careful if you did too much jerking with a pinch collar or something is their head would drop down you know as, as really just like a, the, the muscle memory the reflex Christoph Christopher Christopher oh Christoph she's just ruining the training but you see how the other day at the campground, when that dog was kind of sniffing, this is really what kind of conditions him for that. All right, so get his head up with the treat. So that's kind of where we're starting out, you guys. Eventually we'll have him spinning and doing all that, but for right now, get, choreograph the part where the dog's head is up prior to the turn. The dog's head needs to be up or it's not going to come off properly. And if we've had a couple in the past. Christoph! Christopher! They would kind of drop their head down. It makes it very, very difficult. So, but just this initial stage, this is your, this is your little subtasks on your turn towards. Anyway, you guys, Chester's one of my favorite dogs in the world. I just love this little dog. All right, you guys. See ya.